Time for an easy throw together midweek meal that is so simple to prepare but is bursting with flavour. Let's make this beautiful cheesy bacon and tomato gnocchi bake on the One Pot Chef. First things first, we've got a pot of boiling water and to that I'm going to add in 500 grams of potato gnocchi. Now, try not to splash it everywhere like I've just done. <laughs> but basically this is one of the easiest ways to make pasta because this sort of halfway between pasta and potato dumplings, what you do is you drop it into the boiling water and only after about a minute or two they'll start popping to the surface and when they bob up to the surface you know they're done. You can just scoop them out with a slotted spoon. Lovely. We'll just let them drain off on some paper towel. I've got a large deep fry pan and I put a little bit of olive oil in there and over a medium to high heat I'm going to add in one brown onion which I've just chopped, a couple of cloves of crushed garlic and 200 grams of diced bacon or diced ham. If you don't want to use bacon or ham you could chop up some mushrooms instead. And we're just going to stir this around for a few minutes until the onions have started to soften. After about three or four minutes the onions have nicely softened so we can start adding in our chilli. I'm putting in one long red chilli which I have just removed the seeds and diced up. I'm also adding in a 400 gram can of diced tomatoes and give that a good stir together. Reduce the heat slightly and allow this to simmer uncovered for about five minutes or until the mixture thickens slightly. Season with a little salt and pepper to taste then simply add the gnocchi into the sauce. Stir that together. Carefully transfer into a casserole dish. Top with some grated cheese. I'm using some grated mozzarella today. And all that's left to do is to pop this into the oven, preheated oven, 200 degrees Celsius, 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the cheese is melted and bubbly. And here we have our completed cheesy bacon and tomato gnocchi bake and it is absolutely gorgeous. That cheese is nice and melted and bubbly and it's got a lovely goldenness to it. It's absolutely stunning. The kitchen smells amazing. I cannot wait to dive in and taste this. Mm -mm -mm, that looks yummy. All right, time for a quick taste. Dive in and grabs. Oh, this is still hot. <laughs> Mmm. Oh wow. Mmm. <laughs> beautiful. The gnocchi is beautiful and tender and has taken on all of those amazing flavours in the casserole. The tomato, the onion, uh, the bacon, even the little bit of the chilli. The chilli has got that little background flavour there but it's not too hot. It's just got the flavour of it and it's absolutely fantastic. And of course anything covered in cheese is always good. Serve this with a side salad or some mixed boiled or steamed vegetables and you've got a fantastic midweek meal that anyone can put together absolutely stress free. Well I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Don't forget to check me out on social media on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter and of course my website onepotchefshow.com and until next time see you later. A cool little twist for this recipe is the gnocchi itself. If you don't want to spend all the time boiling the water and stuff like that you can go for the quicker option. Simply pan fry the gnocchi in a fry pan with a little bit of butter and a little bit of olive oil. It'll crisp up on the outside and go soft and chewy on the inside and it will be absolutely fantastic.